Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley B. Deck. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Today I've teamed up with Wig Fever to bring you this beautiful body wave lace wig. Now what's so special about this one is that this is a pre-cut lace wig. So you don't have to do anything at all. And to add the icing on the cake, it's glueless. So you're going to see in just a minute when I pull it out of the box. You guys see the hairline and how beautiful it is. It's not bonded down at all. Now, of course, you can cut more lace off. You can add baby hair. You can for sure do whatever you would like to customize your wig. But the beauty in this one is that it comes literally ready to go. You take it out of the box. You put it on your head. And literally, you are good to go. So I did do a little finesse you guys know me i love to add a little one two and give you some tips on trips on how to make it look natural and like it's coming out of the scalp as i mentioned this one is a body wave texture so we are going to be wand curling it because to me body wave looks so much better um when you want to have like the sexy sassy curls i feel like a wand curler is the best um option so we're going to do some wand curls today and we're going to be going ahead and melting the lace without having any product or glue to it so without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into the tutorial be sure to subscribe if you haven't already we are on the road to 300,000 subscribers on this channel and without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into it let's get started okay ladies jumping right into it today we're working with wig fever this is the wig and they do have some goodies in there i'll show in just a moment today i'm working with a body wave 26 inch pre-cut lace wig this one is going to fit glueless and this is a close-up of what the actual wig looks like now you could go in and bleach the knots the remainder of the knots it is set as a center part and look how beautiful the texture is the body wave on this one for sure is body waving so this is the end Inside construction of the cap as I mentioned the lace is pre-cut and I loved how they gave it like that scalpel cut so it's kind of jagged and it's not perfect or too blunt they also included an adjustable elastic band so you know I'm gonna adjust it and make it a little bit tighter because there's not much work needed I'm gonna go in and prepare my wig before I put it on by tensing the lace you guys can see how adding a foundation powder that is my exact skin color um, just warms up the lace and it's just gonna make it look a little bit more glueless now let's go ahead and apply the wig you guys know I love to put the elastic band on first here I'm showing you that the wig does fit glueless all the way around the wig definitely fits snug on the back of my head and for sure it fits in the front I'm loving the body I'm loving the length this one is 26 inches in in length and since it already came set as a center part and it is a closure I'm just going to go ahead and perfect that parting and make sure that it's nice and sharp and then I'm going to go in with the dynamic duo you guys already know this is my favorite step I love to go in with a wax stick paired with the electric hot comb and really just go in and make sure that it is on flat flat no lumps no bumps super flat and smooth and then I'm going to repeat that same step on the opposite side now these products do come from my company and I do use the electric hot comb like on the highest setting which is 500 degrees. I know that is a lot so be warned and be prepared for a lot of heat. You can definitely do this on a wig head if you are afraid of you know burning yourself. Now this is a good shot of what the hair looks like. I love this texture on me. I honestly would keep it as is and just add a little oil sheen or like a nice little serum. I don't feel the need to go in and jazz it up on a daily. I love the way the natural texture texture just looks in real life but for the sake of the video we are going to go ahead and wand curl it here I am just making sure the lace blends in seamlessly now this here is um I believe that was the Maybelline fit me foundation in coconut 360 I'll have the exact color in the description box I feel like when there is a little bit of a white cast on your lace adding a liquid product will take that away in a way that sometimes a powder foundation will not i did go ahead and set that liquid with a powder as well and then i use that same maybelline foundation in the parting i usually like to use a concealer but because the center seemed to not have um, any knots to conceal i just wanted to add color to make sure it matched my complexion the foundation actually worked perfect 
Now I'm going to start the process of wand curling. As I mentioned, this is going to be, to me, the best way to make the waves that come with your body wave textures pop. And on this side, I am curling towards my face. Typically and generally, I prefer to curl away for a more bombshell look. But on this side, I believe I curled towards my face and then on the opposite side I went away from my face forgive me if you see me looking up and away I was watching a new series that I found on Netflix it was like I literally turned on the tv um when I started working and for literally I finished the entire series I think it was either like four to six episodes um I think it was like a UK UK based show but it was so good the white the girl she was dating the daddy and the son she was marrying the son and then you know the wife didn't know that her husband was having an affair with this lady he was so the husband was so obsessed with her I don't know it was crazy you gotta watch it I highly 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 recommend it but I'm just going ahead and just wanding bigger sections now what you're not seeing is that each section I take I am smoothing it out with the um, comb and I did go ahead and add a little bit of oil sheen before I started this hair was so soft and fluffy I just want to add a little bit of hold or not hold but oil to kind of give it a little bit of more weight and that definitely helped you can definitely also add a holding spray if you choose now I also love the fact that this one fits glueless this is a great everyday wig you can definitely customize it to your liking but I definitely love the way it came out on me and this has been my current gym wig of the week now I did go in with the little shapers in the front I wanted to make sure that that area was super 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 smooth and the hair there was super straight and it looked like it was growing out of my scalp just adding a little bit of hairspray and using that heat definitely did a great job of making the hairline look super super smooth and like it was growing out of the scalp i repeated that step on the opposite side and i also wand curled the opposite side off camera you guys already know it never comes out perfect the right side uh is more defined than the left side the back needs to be touched up but you know it is what it is i took a break um off camera so the curls definitely began to drop but i'm just going to go in with the dimming brush and just kind of um pull the curls out and it looks beautiful i'm going to add a little bit more of the oil sheen and the reason is because the hair is so soft and fluffy and and because it was like a beautiful body wave texture it was meant to just be nice and fluffy but for curls you kind of want it to kind of be a little bit more weighed down so that the curls pop more and the oil sheen did a great job of that now again I love the right side better than the left side but sometimes you just can't win them both you can definitely go in and flexi rod them to help to preserve your curls and yeah I love the way this one came out wow look at that that looks so beautiful i'm watching a movie it's called obsession on netflix is this lady her name is anna she is dating this guy and she is having an affair with his dad i think she met the dad first but she got some sick twisted stuff going on from her childhood so she is dating the guy she marries the guy they go to paris together the dad is obsessed with her so he's following her when they travel to paris he traveling to paris and meet me outside they doing craziness in the alley it's like they have like a uk accent or something like that anyways so back to the hair i went ahead and did this one and it was super simple and easy and of course it's enjoyable when you got like good music or a good show to watch so I did the wand curlers and I did I wanted to use some shapers to give it a little bit of hold but I'm out like how do you run out of hairspray and you can definitely pull some baby hair forward if you want to bond her down I'd recommend if I'm not mistaken this is the first time you're seeing wig fever on this channel this hair is so beautiful hopefully you'll see them again in the future this is their packaging and inside i think this is a bonnet yeah i was assuming this was a bonnet it definitely is super cute with the purple and then it has like the lighter like lavender in the inside we love a good bonnet moment we always need another bonnet and then inside the box you do have some goodies oh this was nice they gave this long piece of thin elastic now i'm actually happy about this you guys know i have my own this i don't know sometimes it screams a little bit ghetto when you have your logo even though i'm representing myself it feels a little ghetto like to me i don't feel ghetto when i wear it but when i see other people do it it's like girl she got a melt belt on at the party at the club at the gym i get it but this definitely is a lot more discreet and this is just a thin piece of elastic and it's perfect because like tonight if I wanted to um, make sure that like when we going up and back and forth in the Pilates it's in, my hair has definitely snagged in like the reformer before to make sure that like it don't fly off you just put this at the very 
edge of the hairline and it's actually keeping it in place and of course tie it tight underneath so i'm actually gonna use this i'm gonna actually put that with my gem stuff because that's perfect to be a little bit more discreet they did also give me a pair of hd wig caps this is just a larger like satin um scarf it's the thing when that goes around the hairline and it looks like it says wig fever it has the same logo as the bonnet so that's super cute it has the same logo as the bonnet does um a rat tail comb and it does say wig fever trending leader i know that's right and then just a purple dust bag so they definitely gave us some free goodies we love a good free goodie moment as i said it's 100 percent glueless i use no product to bond it down and from side to side you can see that it fits flat it's not bulky or anything like that the hairline is ex i mean the parting rather is extended and absolutely beautiful nothing there at all so be sure to check out wig fever directly Direct link to this wig is in the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches.